There we go. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> Baby, yeah! Hello everybody, Grey Still Plays, and I'm here with a new game for the channel. This is BeamMG.Drive. For those of you who don't know, this is probably one of the most accurate physics-based driving games in the universe. And I imagine the team over there possibly saw my terrible driving skills with my summer car and decided to try and do something to help old Grey learn how to drive. We got a bunch of scenarios here that involve all kinds of craziness, a bunch of crashes, a bunch of uh, time scenarios, and also precision scenarios. I have played like 20 minutes of this game in total, so I'm probably absolutely terrible. Let's see if we can complete any of these and get me into a proper finish rally car driving level. Okay, so this one says rush hour, crash, challenge, pike, and what the hell? Stuvisiant? Coolidge? Traffic times two, minimum score of 200k. Drop down onto Coolidge to hit the traffic. One thing though, the wide lanes will probably make it tough to wreck both cars. Let's do it. Here we go, baby. Gray still plays on the license plate. I assume we just go straight ahead. Oh, this is interesting. So we have to get right between these two cars. Here we go. Shit. All right, one more time. I'm, I feel, I'm feeling it, baby. We're gonna get these sons of bitches. You ruined my life. <laughs> yeah. That's what time it is. Was the damage a success? Nice! Total damage! Is that 1.4 million dollars in damage? Jesus Christ! Well, I hope we have good insurance. Oh yeah, baby, I think I'm getting the hang of this. All right, we gotta try this one more time. I wanna see if I can beat 1.4 million dollars in damage. I wanna get full speed here. Full speed, you sons of bitches! Huh. Oh, I missed. Crap! Gray still plays is going to single-handedly keep keep all of the insurance companies alive. Here we go. Oh, oh no. Oh wait, maybe we got him. Yes. Only what is that? Only one million dollars in damage that time. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, come on, baby. One point five at least. I wonder if we can get our car going sideways. Maybe that'll do a little bit better. Okay, we're gonna kinda go at an angle, right, like this. How about that? That wasn't too bad. I think we missed the other car, though. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, we got him. Oh, $768,000? There is really something oddly satisfying about destroying cars that are worth, like, half a million dollars each. Oh, I think I'm gonna become addicted to this game. All right, here we go. Oh, I already flattened a tire. How the hell? <laughs> Son of a bitch. Well, we're definitely connected. Oh, we got them both. 1.1 million dollars. Wow, our best shot was our very first, well, second. The first time was kind of met in horrible failure. But our very second time trying. I feel pretty good about that. Let's see what the next challenge is. Okay, this one says special delivery crash challenge Pike and Lombard. Traffic times two, minimum score 10K. Catching air isn't just a style thing. Use it for inciting rollovers, impromptu lane changes, and yes, style. Pretty useful when you have a big top heavy vehicle blocking a smaller one or just want to look awesome. Oh, I've seen one and I know how this goes. What are we, what are we driving here? What the hell is this? Like an Acura or something? Okay, so, uh... Oh shit! Oh, we're still in one piece! All we have is a deflated tire. That's no big deal, I've driven on, I've dri oh shit. Okay, I think the idea here is to like wait until just the right time. Maybe right about now. Okay, here we go. Ow! Never mind. Son of a bitch. Oh, we're still on. So, do I get to go anywhere else? No, I don't. Come on, baby. All I want is to land on top of the delivery truck. Here we go. Right here. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Oh, we're inside. We're inside. We're penetrating the truck. We've penetrated deep into the heart of the delivery vehicle. That's what I'm talking about, penetrate him. Okay, so those were some of the less new challenges. Let's go into some of the newer ones. These ones just came out a couple days ago. These are called the Twin Ramps Crash Challenge, Hiawatha Pike, traffic times three. And it says you're up here, your targets are down there. This time around, you have not one, but two ramps you could use to hit your target. Choose wisely, all right. I love having options for maximum destruction. Let's do this. So how many targets do we actually have? We got one ramp right over here. So, I think we're gonna land, yes! Knock it over, knock it over, come on, but no! Total failure, man, what is that supposed to get us? That's terrible, that better not be a success. 
That was, that was not a success at all. All right, this time I'm going to get a little bit more speed right off the gate here. We're going to hit this second ramp. Let me see here. Oh, shit. Or I'll just miss the ramp totally and start... <laughs> oh, God. Wait, the vehicle's still... It's still in one piece. Does it still count? Can I still drive around? No, fuck this. We're going off the... We're going off-road. Screw it. I have to get my aim down. This is going to make me a proper rally car driver if I can get the aim down. Okay, so we're... We're spinning right in front of the other potential vehicle. Damn it! Well, I guess if anything, maybe we gave the other car drivers, like, cardiac events and they had heart attacks and that's the way that we caused an accident? That was absolutely dreadful. Now that I know that traffic comes the other way, though, hold on. Hold on, we just gotta get real set here. Okay, right about like this. I think not only will we hit this. Oh, come on, man. Oh, we're riding it. Ride it like it's, ride it like a horse. Do we have anything behind us? No, there's just some cars kind of going that way. $129,000 in damages. Mm. Man, there's just not enough crashing going on. We gotta find a way to get in the middle of all three vehicles. I think it just takes more practice to do crashing. It's like a crashing simulator. This should be called Crash NG. I can feel it coming in the air tonight. I'm a dirty noob and I missed everyone. God damn it. Come on. Come on, you bastard. All right, not, not here, not here, not here. Right about here. Nope. Not there either. Oh, damn it! Come on! Okay, I think I'm just turning a little bit too hard. Let me, let me try and hit the, let me try and hit this, like, more on this side. Okay, we have a lot of air here. But all the air in the world didn't help. Oh, there, there goes our tire doing flips and shit. So the key is to maximize the damage by starting, I think, over on this side of the road. There we go. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> Baby, yeah! That was pretty damn cool. Oh God, look at the freaking, look at the box on our truck. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. $500,000 in damage. We gotta get, we gotta get both of those cars at the very least though. I need to learn how to swap up the camera angles a bit too. Let me try that. All right. Oh, oh no, we're not gonna make it. Okay, maybe I'll go all camera angle crazy once I actually like get into the potential damage areas. Oh. And man, you know, for the as cool as that crash was, I feel like it was terribly wasted without actually coming in contact with another vehicle. Ugh. Okay. You gotta feel it. You gotta feel it with both hands. You gotta feel it, baby! Here we go! No, overshot it! Come on! Oh, that is a cool caterwheel there. To go all cattywampus on me now. Slow down just a little bit. Don't need that much speed, man. We don't need that much speed. We just need to get there. Yes! Excellent! An upside down head on collision with the truck. I don't think there's that much damage though. I mean, what's this truck really worth? Like maybe 50 grand or so? Okay, $189,000. Didn't quite expect that. I assume this is because that vehicle was transporting like a ton of cocaine or something. I think we'll give this maybe like one or two more goes. I just, man, I really want to get both of those vehicles. This looks good! Damn it! I think we need a little bit more speed and to go a little bit further over, probably. Shit, I missed. Okay, whatever, we'll do it this way then. Whoa! Did that even count? Hold on, what's going on behind us? Oh, it looks good though. That's a hell of a lot of damage to those hatchbacks. Yes, the old, the old Ford Raptor or whatever versus some hatchbacks. $1.3 million, man. The, the key is to not even use the ramps. I really want to use the ramps, though. Oh, holler at your boy if you want to see them crashes. Oh, come on. We're right on line. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Yes. The cars have met and all is right in the world. Oh, God, finally. Okay, so this is the last one. This is called the Coolidge Run. It says it's a time trial. We got 20 seconds and we're basically going the wrong way in traffic. So it looks like the cars start like right away on top of us. All right, let's do this. They're all peeling out as well. Nice. Oh, whoa, Jesus Christ. Yeah, this is no big deal, man. We're gonna, oh, they're changing lanes now as well. No, no, you motherfucker. Okay, so you just gotta watch for the 18 wheeler in the end there. As long as we stay in the middle, we're pretty good for quite some time. This guy's gonna change lanes, no big deal. 18, 
damn it! All right, our our nemesis, our kryptonite. Oh, it's raining outside too. Why not? Is that 18 wheeler? We just got to stay away from him at all costs. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna hang more. I was gonna say we're gonna hang more on the other side of the road, but instead we decided to create a mass casualty incident by essentially killing everyone that is trying to get to work today. This is the worst crash that we've had. This is worse than when we were doing jumps. The truck is on top of us. It has mated with our vehicle, and I think that we're on top of another vehicle. Hold on, let me pull around here. Yep, sure have on top of another vehicle right here. I love how all these trials are considered easy and I'm doing so poorly. Clearly I understand why I had to get this game now. Oh God. All right, that worked out fairly well. You know, what if I just go on this side? Damn it. Oh my God. Have my, eat my bumper tanker. Maybe I could ride this. Maybe I could like ride way over here. I wonder if this is essentially cheating. Like, can you, are you allowed to do this? I, I wouldn't think that you would be allowed to do this. Just kind of squeeze. Oh, that, that is cheap as hell. Wow, oh, we, <laughs> it just, it just sends you off the edge there. Okay, that's BS though, that is bullshit. We, we cannot win in that fashion. 14 seconds just by cheating, hold on. All right, here we go. We're gonna do this the right way this time, not the pansy way. We're gonna, we're gonna meet our fears head on. There are no fears at all, we can best them. We can best the yes, 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 fuck. Ow. <laughs> we did it. We did it. Yes, the Coolidge run is ours. All right, so we're going to end up with this one here. This one's called Failure to Merge. It's basically just a giant crash challenge where you try and rack up as much money as possible. Sounds like just my thing. Let's freaking do this. Now, I'm not really sure what you need to do besides just like score as much as you can. So I guess that's what we're gonna attempt to do. So we have at least, okay, right here. That was a couple of vehicles, we managed to miss them all. Yeah, this is the type of game that gives you the failure when you should be getting a safe driving award. So clearly the key is involving every single vehicle we can. Oh, I wonder if we can get right in the middle of everything, hold on. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I think we got at least two vehicles. Hold on, let me swing around here and take a look. Eh, we just, we really just kind of clipped them for $600,000. What are these vehicles made out of? Like solid gold? Well, you clip a vehicle and it's $600,000 in damage. Okay, I kind of like to see if we can sandwich ourselves between all these cars. Maybe we can kind of like get in between, yeah, like this, and then kind of like slam it like that. Oh, head on is definitely the way to go. Are we still able to move? No, we're not. $800,000 worth of damage, but one guy got away. The one that got away, I don't want him to get away. Oh, challenge gods of beam NG. Allow me, allow me to win this. Oh, this looks good. Yes, 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 yes. What a pile up. That's more like it, man. It's only $750,000 in damage, but I think we got every single vehicle, which is exactly what I wanted to do. That was really cool. Okay, so, so far, I'm really liking Beam NG. I want to try all kinds of new challenges, though. I hope that people keep coming out with cool scenarios. Man, if these, if these crashes can get more and more insane, I think I'm going to have a lot of fun with this game. Guys, I hope you're enjoying Beam NG. It's going to teach me how to be a better driver and rack up as much damage as possible. Until next time, folks, stay foxy and much love.